In this video, we're going to attempt to find out how long it's going to take Maria to clean a room. We're told that Adam can clean the room in three hours, and if his sister Maria is helping him and they're working together, it takes two and two-fifths hours. So how long will it take Maria to do the job alone? Well, let's consider what we know about Adam, Maria, and the team. Adam does the job in three hours. We're given that. We're also told that if his sister Maria is helping as a team, they can do it in two and two-fifths hours. Now, we don't really like doing math with mixed numbers, so let's change that into an improper fraction. Five times two is ten, plus two is twelve, so it takes twelve-fifths hours for them to do it as a team. What we're curious about is how long is it going to take Maria, we'll make her x, to do the job alone. Well, let's consider how much of the job gets done every hour. Per hour would be the reciprocal of these times. So the, what we're going to do is we are going to take the reciprocal of the first person plus the reciprocal of the second person equals the reciprocal of the team working together. So what would that look like for this problem? Well, Adam, his three hours, his reciprocal, one-third of the job getting done every hour. Plus Maria, her reciprocal is one over x of the job getting done each hour, will equal the reciprocal of the teamwork time, which is five-twelfths. Now we have an equation we can solve for x. The way we solve these rational equations is we identify the least common denominator, which in this case is 12x, and so we will multiply each term on both sides of the equation by 12x. And reduce. 12 over 3 is 4. 4 times x times 1 is 4x. The x's divide out, plus 12 equals the 12's dividing out, 5x. Now we can continue solving this equation. Move the variable to one side by subtracting 4x off of both, and we find out 12 is equal to x, which is Maria's time. It takes Maria 12 hours to complete the job. We found that time by considering their individual times and the teamwork times, written as a fraction, no mixed numbers, and then we make our equation out of all three reciprocals. We add the reciprocals of the individual to equal the reciprocal of the teamwork time. We can then solve the equation by clearing the fraction with the least common denominator.